Yellowstone volcano, likely to erupt at Park pinpointed after unstable discovery. The caldera, which last experienced a super eruption more than 640,000 years ago, spreads below the states of Wyoming, Montana, and Idaho. It is a significant threat in the event history repeats itself and so the system is constantly monitored by the USGS, United States Geological Survey, for any changes. One branch of their research is monitoring hydrothermal explosion, which occurs when superheated water trapped below the surface of the Earth rapidly converts from liquid to steam, violently disrupting the confining rock. Boiling water, steam, mud, and rock fragments are ejected over an area of a few meters up to several miles in diameter. Geologist Dr. Patrick Muffler revealed during the Inside USGS documentary. He said, We started finding crater-like features in the hot spring area, particularly in Pocket Basin, which is in Lower Giza Basin. It turned out to be the classic hydrothermal explosion feature, meaning that the upper part of a hot spring that is everywhere at the boiling point becomes unstable for a variety of reasons and basically explodes. No magma is involved. It's not like a free to magmatic eruption. This is just an inevitable happening in the upper part of a hydrothermal system where the temperatures along the boiling point curve are increasing very rapidly. That, of course, creates a very unstable situation. Yellowstone National Park is a thermally active area with an extensive system of hot springs, fumaroles, geysers, and mud pots. Dr. Muffler went on to reveal how researchers map these out. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to us on YouTube. If you like donate to us visit home on the page PayPal.